Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome to Straight to Blu-ray. My name is James, and it is finally time for another collection update. I know it's been a few weeks before I've done one of these. I haven't bought too, too many movies lately, uh, but I do have a good five movies here that I've picked up recently. Most of these are either from the Disney Movie Club and or uh, the Disney Movie Insiders. So I'll go ahead and show you everything that I have picked up within the past few weeks. Hey guys, thanks for checking out the channel. If you're new here, please think about hitting that like and subscribe button. I post videos at least a couple times a week on various movie related topics, including this one, which is my collection update. Uh, I used to do these every week. They'll always be on a Wednesday, um, but this, you know, I hadn't bought, bought too many recently, uh, trying to save up some money. So, but I did finally pick some up. So I know it's been a few weeks, uh, but finally got enough movies here to actually do a video on it. So let's go ahead and get into what I picked up. All right, this first one is one that I got from the Disney Movie Club. Um, this one is actually one that was my feature title, and I did, in fact, accept it. I didn't forget and screw this one up. Uh, and that is going to be the 70th anniversary edition of Peter Pan. Like I said, this is they've been doing a bunch of these lately, these uh, anniversary editions on different ones, so I try to pick these up when I can. So, yeah, this is the uh, 70th anniversary, the original Peter Pan animated one. Um, got that, and it actually whoops, shook the camera. Uh, came with, since I actually remembered to do it, I got the uh, collectible lithograph here for Peter Pan, and I'm assuming they messed up because I actually got two. The other is the uh, Ant-Man uh, lithograph here, the Ant-Man and the Wasp. I got this one kind of with it. I kind of get the feeling that they uh, accidentally sent two instead of one, but hey, I'll take it. So yeah, the uh, first pickup was Peter Pan, the 70th anniversary edition. All right, the next one I got actually came along with that one from the Disney Movie Club. And this is, like I said, they are doing a lot of these anniversary ones. This is the 60th anniversary of Disney's Sword in the Stone. Uh, no lithograph with this one, just the one that came with it. But yeah, so Sword in the Stone, 30th, or I'm sorry, 30th, 60th anniversary of this Blu-ray. Both of them are Blu-ray, DVD, um, digital code. Uh, got a little bent on the, um, I don't know if you can see that, on the corner there when it came in. The packaging they use for these is not the best. Um, yeah, it's definitely a little bent there. It's not the best. I mean, I know Amazon puts, it's kind of like, you know, they'll put them in those sleeves, those plasticky sleeves that they send you, but there's room in there for it to move around. The Disney Movie Club, when they give you something, it's like in a bag. It's not, not a bag, but it's like a papery kind of bag, I guess, that they put in there. But it's real, like, I mean, it's snug in there. So they, you know, they shove as much as they can in there. And sometimes it can bend some of these. So unfortunately, it got bent a little bit, but yeah. Got uh, Disney's Sword and the Stone 60th Anniversary Edition from the Disney Movie Club. All right, these next three are actually ones that I picked up from the Disney Movie Insiders, which is, um, you know, when you buy Disney movies, they have the, you know, you can use your digital code, but you can also enter another code in and you get points where you can spend on certain things for the Disney Movie Insider. So usually for the points, I'll either A, buy like a movie poster I want, or I'll just get other movies. So you basically get them for free. Uh, weren't really any posters I wanted, so decided to pick up some movies. Uh, first one is going to be something that I know a lot of people didn't like. I haven't actually seen it, so I figured I'd give it a try. And I mean, it was free since I used my points. And that is going to be Oz the Great and Powerful with uh, James Franco in it. Like I said, I know a lot of people uh, not a huge fan of this one, but I technically haven't seen it. So I decided to go ahead and give it a try. Um, so yeah, Oz the Great and Powerful, a, a free one with my points. Uh, another free one I picked up with my points is one that I had previously um, that I ended up selling when I sold a bunch of movies. So I finally got this one back. Unfortunately, the first time I got it, I had a slipcover and this one did not get a slipcover. That is going to be the 4K edition of uh, Free Guy here. I never, when I even, when I had the other one, I never even watched it. Uh, so I haven't actually seen this. It's technically a, well, a blind free. I, don't, I know there's a blind buy, but I didn't pay for this. It was a blind free uh, so for a free guy, hey, that works out. Uh, so pick this one up as well uh, with the points. And then finally with the points, um, another one I got for free. This is one I, uh, it's the same situation I had previously and then I sold it. Uh, this one I had a slipcover the first time and got the slipcover this time as well. And that is going to be Luca. Um, I did see this one. I got it the first time. I, I enjoyed this one. I thought it was a pretty good movie. So yeah, I was able to get this. This is the 4K edition. Like I said, actually, uh, actually got the slipcover on this one. So definitely... A little surprised. I know if you don't pick up something, you know, right away, the, the odds of this you getting the slipcover with it go down, down, down the, the longer you wait. But 
glad I was at least able to uh, to grab all three of those with my points. So uh, yeah, uh, that is it for all of the movies I picked up this week. Like I said, I've been kind of holding off, uh, you know, trying to save up a little bit of money. Obviously, three of these were free, so <laughs> but by trying to save up a lot of money. I do have a, a couple movies coming, but it'll probably be another few weeks before I um, do another collection update video. So leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you thought about some of these uh, movies that I picked up. And uh, hopefully everybody had a really good 4th of July. This should be posting on the day after the 5th of July. So hopefully you all had a good and safe 4th of July. And as always, everybody, thanks so much for watching. And I will see you all in the next video.